Hey everybody, it's your boy Celery Stick. Holy crap, don't starve. We are back. The six feet under patch is enabled. Let's do this. So, play. Okay, so through after all this thinking and hemming and hawing, I figure, you know what? Let's do Wicker Bottom. I think she's kind of cool. You guys wanted to see her as well. And honestly, I have no clue how to play as her. So we're going to see what happens. I know that she doesn't need like a science machine. She already gets that. But like what kind of books she has and stuff, I don't even know. I do know you get some papyrus when you spawn as her, I think. Oh, look. There's Maxwell. Yeah, I don't look so good. Pal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So you'll notice I got the RPG HUD working again. Aw, oh, yeah. It's a little different. The the modder changed the UI a little bit. And the, uh, the temperature and the naughtiness meters up there. So let's look at our map. All right, there we are. Let's get started. Okay, I can zoom right out a little bit now. That's with the new RPG HUD mod, so we can get a better field of view. Wow, that's almost... Wow, that's really far out. That is a really good mod. Awesome. Let's zoom back in a little bit. Okay, what do we got? We got a decent savanna biome right away. We got lots of bunnies. We got even a pond, which is kind of nice. We can go fishing. Lots of turf, or sorry, lots of grass. This is looking really good. We got some rocks. Let's look at that map real quick. Let's keep looking around though. I don't want to take the first place we find. Lots of berries. Okay, that's the end of this part of the island. Is that right? Sure seems like it. Okay. Wow, look at their hurt glasses. Let's take a look at Wicker Bottom real quick. Pretty cool. I really like her glasses. She looks like a librarian. I kind of like that librarian look. All right, I, let's pick up these berries too. I don't know what I was thinking. We're gonna run out of food. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Sweet. And one more thing of grass, just so we can start a fire if we have to by nighttime. Is that right? So now I can make a. Oh. Campfire needs logs. Okay, so I need to make an axe. Right. I completely forgot how to play the game. Oh my gosh. Okay. So there's some flint. Awesome. Hop to it, Wicker Bottom. Let's get this flint. Nice. Oh, and some carrots. Even better. Okay. So now I can make me an axe. Yeah. All right, we have an axe. Let's cut down some trees. I forgot how slow all the other characters chop trees down. I'm used to Woody just like fucking buzzing through it. Okay, let's do that. All right, we have enough wood now, I think, to chop our... Yeah, we have enough to make a campfire. Awesome. Come on, pick up the pace, Wicker Bottom. Gosh, come on. We're trying to do this for fun. We got to survive. All right, okay. Let's head on back this way. Where are we going now? Oh, a wormhole already. Hmm. Now, she's got a pretty decent sanity meter as well. That's pretty awesome. Okay. So, we know where there's one wormhole. I kind of want to take it, but I don't want to take it just yet. Okay, we found ourselves a bunch of ponds. This isn't a bad biome either. We could set up and get a lot of food here. This isn't a swamp either. What is this? I've never seen so many ponds. Have you guys ever seen that before? Let me know in the comments, guys, if you guys have ever had a spawn with that many ponds in one spot. Okay, so that went in a complete circle, I guess. Alright, what's over here? We got, hmm. Just a bunch of different, like, this is just like dirt biomes. <laughs> dirt floor biomes. This is like living in the projects biomes. <laughs> okay. That's okay. Alright. Oh, what's this? A ring thing. Is that on the map now? No, let's put it right on the map so we can find it later. Sweet. Alright. So, okay, it looks like it's closer to winter than I thought. Holy, it's like, wow, okay. Got some more grass, we'll pick that up. All right, we're at the bottom of the peninsula. We'll chop this tree down just because it's a big one and I don't want that to be another tree ent. No more Optimus Pines. There we are. We'll pick up these to plant them by the base whenever we decide. Okay, let's go back to the right, let's keep going. Oh, wow, that was a big anus. Holy, that anus scared the crap out of me. Okay. There's lots of flowers around here. It's good. We should pick up all the grass we can, I suppose. Somebody told me you should have a stack of twigs and grass before you start your base. I read that somewhere, I think. I'm not sure. I mean, I suppose you could, like, I suppose you could do that in your first couple days. Just go around collecting resources. I mean, that's what we did in our woody playthrough, and well, look where that got us. I don't know if that had anything to do with our gameplay or our fighting ability or just how bad I- Oh! Aw, oh, I wanted to kill him, but no boomerang. Okay. 
Let's go there. Sweet. Carrot, don't mind if I do. Hey guys, we're back. It's day two now, just past morning. We found this pretty awesome savanna biome. It's pretty cool. I mean, we got ourselves like a crap ton of bunnies. There was a bunch of beefaloes over there. We've got us some poop already. Let's take a look at the map real quick. Ooh, this is a big biome too. One thing is, oh wow, there's a lot of bunny farms. Bunny holes, pardon me. One thing is, I haven't seen too much stone. Now we saw some stone at the beginning of the map. Which was pretty cool, but it's pretty far away from where we are. Like, we can't even get back there anyway easy. I think we spawned over here. But there was some stone up here. And there's another... There might be another wormhole somewhere around here. Maybe. Maybe for Lucky. I saw one, I think. I just don't know where it goes. And I don't know if I'm ready to take the hit on the sanity just yet. What do you think, Wickerbottom? She has no clue. Okay. This is... Oh, I'll take those. This was like one of the biggest savanna biomes I've ever seen it's just gigantic like this is actually a really good camp lots of bunnies lots of grass we can plant our own trees we can plant our farms we wouldn't have to worry about the hounds coming from one side we could really protect it off the coast it's just it's gonna make it a pain in the butt traveling all the time like a real pain in the butt and I don't know where we get any silk from I haven't seen any spider dens and like in this game I heard like I was turtling a bit like I was maybe like staying in my base but hey, that's cool too. Let's go check it out. What's over here? Ah, oh, there we go. Forest biome. A lot of stone just laying around. Awesome. Pick that up. Sweet. Okay. Alright, there's the other wormhole. I wonder where this goes. Okay, there's a sinkhole. I don't want to pick that yet. One, I don't have a pick. And two, I'm going to get bats everywhere. Hey! We got some pig friends. Oh yeah. I'm so going to murder lies these guys later, or I'm going to use this to my advantage when the hounds come to own me later. Let's just steal up all their, all their straw or their grass real quick. Awesome. And it looks like we found the pig king. Oh no. Atmospheric moisture. Oh, I hate it when it rains. You know what? I don't think we're going to need to use any pig skins to make ourselves any pig houses because there's plenty of pigs here that we could just run to and defend ourselves if the hounds are coming during the day. If they come at night, we're really going to have to rely on our spike traps and our bee mines, which means I'm actually going to have to make some. Holy crap. I've never had it rain this hard. Oh, man. Okay, so there's that wormhole, the giant anus of doom. Oh, man. I think it's a little ironic that my scapegoat is going to be an anus. Okay. Well, all right. Um, let's look at the map again. Holy, it's so big. Let's just keep exploring. That's what she said. Alright guys, so we've done a crap ton of exploring. Oh my gosh, for like three days, I or two days really, I think we've got a lot explored. I know some of you have probably explored more, but if we found, I guess we found a spider den there. We heard them earlier, there's a beehive, that's pretty good. Well, a huge savanna biome was where I really want us to set up shop. I think like right around here somewhere, there are a bunch of wormholes or giant anuses that I don't know where they go to. And I think it's time we explored one. We're sitting right on top of one, so let's do this. Let's just go for it. Here we go, into the big anus. Ugh. Ugh, that smells nasty. Oh man, that's, ah. Oh. Yeah, a detailed lesson on biology for sure. Okay, where are we? Have we been here? 
awesome. That's exactly what I wanted. That's sweet. Okay. So I think that's what we're going to do. Oh, man. Okay. Or maybe not. I don't know. Oh, we have an escape route. We could head right back up here. I want to know. Oh, man. Okay. Let's, uh, while we're here, we should just collect up all this stone, too. Why not? There's a bunch right here. Oh, that was a pretty good escape. Like, we just jumped right through it. It's too bad it's a big, like, hit on your sanity. Like, 15 hit on your sanity each time you go through. But once we get some jerky set up and we got some honey poultices, I think we'll be okay. So long as we, you know, make it that far. <laughs> okay. We never did explore to the right. Hmm. Okay. Oh, some seeds. Awesome. Oh, a boon. What do we got here? A log suit. Not too bad. 37%. That's pretty good. Better than nothing. We'll pick up these boards. They'll come in handy later. Sweet. Nice. This trip was completely worth it. Are those, are those, I thought there were some rocks here. Oh, they're down there. Okay, let's go mine them up. Come on, wicker bottom. Pick up your feet. This ain't no lab, Brera. She looks really funny when she has her log suit on and her little feet are flying around. Awesome. Okay. Is there another one? Yeah, further down. All right, let's do that. Sweet. Oh, no. Can we build another one? Uh, tools. Nice, okay. No, don't do that. Chop it away. Okay, pick all that up. Alright, let's head back on course here. I really want to see what's off to the right a little bit. We haven't done much exploring this way. It could be like paradise, who knows. Hey guys, so we're back. It's almost nighttime. It's day three, coming up to day four. We did a lot of exploring. Holy, I don't think I've done that much exploring in a while. So we pretty much, oh wow, I didn't even notice. There's another island down here. Maybe it's a peninsula. Wow. Okay, so this savanna biome here, guys, is just, just gigantic. Holy, like, just, just take a look at it. It's big. I think we're going to set up shop here. I think this is a good spot. There's a wormhole here that I'm going to check out where it goes. This wormhole we figured out are connected here. It's pretty cool. I think this one goes up there. I'm not sure. We're going to find out in the morning maybe. Let's let's cook up some of our food here. Our our carrots are holding up better than our berries. Well, uh, let's cook up some of these berries maybe. Nice. That boon was really handy. We got ourselves a log suit. Not that we need it. We should be avoiding all battle at all costs. But hey, we got some. Let's eat that up. Nice. There we go. Strictly vegetarian diet right now, which is all right. Let's see what else we can build. Uh, survival? Can we build a, a backpack? Why not? Let's build one. Equipped, sweet, RPG HUD. You notice it's a little bigger. So we can throw our niter in there, this, this red cap. We could throw... Well, we don't really need to be carrying around those rocks right now, but let's hang on to it. Throw the manure in there, sure. The flint, sure. Well, we could stack these on the same pile. Awesome. Well, guys, let's call it right there. End of day three. We're doing pretty good. In the morning, we're going to check out what's in this wormhole. Right away, next episode, we're going to jump down there and see where we go. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, fave, and subscribe. They really help, and they're really appreciated. Thanks again. See you later. Bye. Mm -hmm.